Good morning, everybody. It's Tuesday, so talk Tuesday. We're gonna attempt this today. Um, it'll be a shorter one. I wanted to show you guys what snowshoeing with the dogs looks like. Um, and this is one of my favorite things because I'm not going the way they think I'm going. And they'll burst and come back and I have to stop to let them go by so I don't get run over. <laughs> All right, so for those who like a head count, we've got 13 today. Come on, peeps. So who do we have? We've got Bailey, we've got Tucker and Kronk there, Newton, Archie, Maggie, Luna, Stella, and Cosmo, Hamish, Luba, Nova, and Petey. So, and as you can hear, this is part of the reason it's going to be a shorter video because I'm sure the audio is just terrible. Um, we're breaking trail today. We broke one loop. We're going to investigate the drop off there. We broke one loop. I'm starting on the second loop. So to give you an idea, if we're not breaking trail, typically we can do all of my loop in about an hour. Um, but because we're breaking trail, we have to break it up a little bit. Um, because it's a bit better today than it was yesterday. Yesterday they were basically swimming, similar to what like Newton is doing, except a little more. Like the crust is just not enough to hold, you see with Bailey there, like it's just not enough to hold everybody all the way there at the trail this time. Um, well, sort of anyway. <laughs> so in the deeper parts, like, we can lose dogs. Like if Kronk steps off the trail into a drift, he's just gone. Um, but yeah. So, I apologize for the audio, like the snowshoe crunch, 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 and in certain places there's wind. Thankfully, what I love about this area is that generally speaking, there's no wind, so when we do have a wind chill, I don't have to worry about it too, too much. Um, and it's also a bit challenging, which I like, because it means I get my exercise in the morning. For all, I like the straight road. It's really good for walking dogs because I can see everything. It's familiar, but it doesn't offer much challenge for me. So this on the other hand is quite the workout. <laughs> so, and this is what I do even with just my guys. Like when I go for a hike with Kronk, I think a couple of you have seen, I've tried out some trails that are like, short driving distance to Ottawa. I find most of the trails in Ottawa are like cross country ski only, so I don't go to them. Uh, so this again is, uh, oh, go on. And this is a lot more interesting walk. Unfortunately, we can't do it in the summer because a lot of it is uh, like raspberries and ferns. So we'd have to make a serious dent in the foliage to walk here. And I, I, it doesn't really make a lot of sense. Not when there's other places. Um, okay, who's walking my snowshoes? Phoebe front. Phoebe, thank you. Nova. Go on, Nova. Um, so yeah, so obviously I do have to train the dogs to not walk on my snowshoes and in winter in particular for them to keep in front of me. Like in the summer, I don't typically care too, too much. Hey, Mish, whatever it is, no. I see that tail. Thank you. Um, Newton! Absolutely not! You know better. Also, we're going this way. So, another thing about having all these different loops and switchbacks and whatever is I don't 
really tell the dogs which way we're going. I just turn. So it keeps them on their toes. Makes them do a lot more running um, to figure out which way I'm going. Which does tend to... Oh, oh Bailey. Which does tend to keep them closer because they have to pay attention. They say is like Tucker's off in the wilderness. But... So we're coming up on one of my favorite spots. Which... I'll try to show you a As you can see, the trail is not for the faint of heart. And this is one of the easier sections. Hey, move along. Tree trying to kill me. So this is one of my favorite. It's a dead end. So we just go down a little bit, but it's really pretty. in here and at some point I think what was it two years ago yeah two years ago I lost the keys to my car here somewhere <laughs> that was my old car not the Toyota thank god but uh yeah that was an adventure for sure and never found them they're somewhere on this hill or maybe they've drifted down the hill and are in the water by now but yeah so this is one of my favorite spots is always much quieter here. And like, the trees are just stunning. So. Hamish! Hamish! If you're trying to roll in it, it's a no. I don't trust you, sir. So yeah, but this is the, I don't go much further. Um, Cause I don't want the dogs near the water in the winter. And then we turn around and we go back up. Are you going to go in front this time, Luke? Good girl. And there's that wind. So hopefully that audio isn't too, too bad. But yeah, that's sort of a taste of what it's like snowshoeing pack walk in the winter. Archie, don't be a jerk. Thank you. You're not Archie and you need to move. Thank you. Um, where? Okay, just checking who I got behind me. Um, yeah, so that's our video for today. Hope you enjoyed it. And uh, as always, if you have any questions, you know what to do. Otherwise, hope you guys are having an awesome Tuesday, have an awesome week, and we'll talk to you soon. Cheers.